Hello kids, welcome to another edition of Senior Pablo's Tutorial Vlog, Elementary Edition. Today you're going to learn properties of addition. And now let us start with number one. First is the commutative property of addition, or what we call the CPA. Means changing the order of the addends does not affect the sum. Let's say I have 7 plus 3. If I am going to change the order, let's say 3 plus 7, the sum does not affect or it will not be different. It will still be the same. So 7 plus 3, that is 10. Also equal to 3 plus 7, 10. Another one, 12 plus 9. Let's change the order. 9 plus 12. So 12 plus 9, that is 21. Also the same with the sum of 9 plus 12, that is 21. Again, what property is this? Commutative property of addition or the CPA. Now let us try some exercises using the commutative property of addition. What if I have 13 plus 10? By commutative, change the order. So that is also equal to 10 plus 13. Next, if I have 54 plus 91. By commutative property, that is equal to 91 plus 54. Next, let's say I have 124, 124 plus 136 that is equal to 136 plus 124 so that is the commutative property of addition 